George Physiotherapist, and I'm here to talk about goal setting with the Meerkat. So when I'm working with a child, what we're looking for is improving their motor skill performance. And in order to do that, what we're looking at doing is providing support, whether that be both static or dynamic, at a point of stability for that child. So just below that area, so we know that we're challenging them. So for example, I might be just slightly lower of trunk, or at hips to challenge trunk because we're struggling a little bit with that level from just trunk up. And how I transition that into the meerkat is that we can set up the points of stability at exactly the point that we need them. And we can quite easily specify that using the markings on the back. Now the reason we want to challenge that point of stability is we need to challenge their, that child's postural control. And by that we mean we challenge their balance. So by, by setting the support, whether that be our hands or the meerkat, we can actually set that support at the level of just below instability. So we're working that child. What we can also do then is actually put the rocker on the base so we can keep static body alignment like we would do in any piece of equipment, which I'm sure, like me, lots of therapists are using, but also then make it dynamic. So we're actually trying to that postural control, so dynamic and static balance, and within doing that, we can start to improve and work towards our goal of improving motor skill performance. Right.